students, we are the team of Integrated Homeopathy. First of all, I would like to thank you all for your warm response and encouraging encouragement. Everybody appreciated the fact that we have started integrated approach as everybody realizes every approach has a limitation. And when we bring everything together, integrate them, we, are, we can uh, multiply our results. So today we are here to share our first case. Uh, this case is from Dr. Shobha's clinic. She will be sharing the case and then we will all give our inputs and understandings to fine tune the understanding and to demonstrate how integrated approach works. So I invite Dr. Shobha to start with the case. Yes, thank you, Anita. I'll see. Yeah. Can you see my screen? Yes. Okay, friends. So, with uh, great at in ICR NJH predictive homeopathy mind rubrics method, I would start with today's fifty-one-year-old uh, female. She is an assistant manager in a company, and she came with a chief complaint of palpitation, and mood swings. Like sometimes she used to get very hyper and angry and sometimes she used to weep a lot. And is going into a lot of overthinking of some difficulty that she had experienced. And see, now she is a, a 15, she is on a higher post in a company. So she has come across many such situations where she needed to handle the image or you know her juniors so she knew ki if such type of condition comes up in the life how to manage and how to knew that how to manage how to handle but she was not able to handle it by herself and that is what also was you know troubling her and this has started since about a year earlier she was quite okay so then i asked her ki uh, what is so friends, we usually being a homeopath understand that there is a, if we try to understand any stressful factor which is available in life during that period of life, uh, that, that period of life since when the chief complaints have started. So I try to inquire about it. So I tried to do the same and um, she told that she, she was the senior most person and her GM, the general manager was just, you know, had just retired and she was, she had thought that she was experienced. But what had happened was that there was another uh, department manager and she applied for this to her manage to their company's managing director. So when this patient came to know that this another manager the patient uh, this patient was taken aback and she went and talked to that managing director now this very well because they had she worked together in many of the activities so he knew her assets so he assured her and um, the patient was also like you know a little bit reassured that okay the things will be meaning she will not have have any interest but um, what happened is after few months uh, she suddenly came to know that the other department manager was announced next gm of the company and this came as a very shock she was deeply hurt you know she was disappointed and the company and went home and she was crying and crying at home and um, she felt that you know it was her her right which was not deserving that right and she felt it was she who deserved and not that person she felt that she had worked so much so hard into the company and that is still why this thing happened to her and that is was that was hurting her the most 
happened was that the next day she resumed the company and uh, like as if nothing has happened in a normal way. But at the back of her mind, so there were a little bit of frictions which were going on in the company between her and the uh, the newly made GM, that other person. And trying to avoid that situations. And But what was happening is during this time, it was also the COVID time and that there were so the whole day she there used to be a lot of things which were going on online and she felt you know that office was too much into the, her personal life also now she being this uh, having in a very quite senior position what had happened is she also had a lot of involvements in a lot of activities of the company so uh, she was uh, not able to you know meaning cut down those responsibilities were there and the logic that was given to her was that um, because she is there into lot of responsibility other person is also given that post you know ki, okay let that person do that so now but the patient was not able or not able to you know uh, take it completely and she felt that it was like her nervous breakdown that she was experiences experiencing she was feeling why she did this uh, after working so sincerely giving 100% to the company why did company give me this and when everyone why it did not come to me so uh, what had happened is that company did try to give her some other uh, responsibility and she, whatever she was given to her was also something which was very responsible which company cannot give to anybody but still she did not and the uh, authority who was there the G, uh, the managing director he, he also told her that your post is higher than hers about it but it was not meaning she was not able to uh, take it up very easily so uh, the things which are coming again and you challenge my seniority why am I targeted and that person who has not done anything for the company so much for company that what everything on platter and if i she also said you know that if i was not efficient i am not efficient in my work if i am not good then you telling this to the md that you then you tell me then i will understand and i will accept it but it was not so if it is not so then it is i am not able to accept and uh, otherwise she had that uh, i have always got more than expectations in life but this has come as a shock in which she so she said I am also taking a much of you know uh, onto myself and to prove that I am good she doesn't like you know uh, but as a reaction when I asked her what are your reactions also like or how is your relation with that uh, newly GM she doesn't like to help that GM in her work now she feels otherwise like in an uh, uh, other case by her she would go out of the way and help whosoever is there on that post but here she felt that I do not like going out of the way and helping this GM I feel that you only do when you wanted that post no now you only do the observation during this uh, so friends, I'm describing and the gist of the conflict, which is the patient has uh, passed through. Okay. So she was the observation was that she was quite surprised. She was also in her tears and deeply hurt. And she was mild by nature. Also, one thing which I liked about her, which I felt that learning lesson of life by attending the office next day of her hurt. Because she said, okay, I wanted to give this lesson to my children. See, suppose we, uh, uh, feel ki tomorrow, if my children also passes, suffers uh, any kind of difficulties in their life, happen that next day, meaning because of the difficulty, they would discontinue their work or they would discontinue their things. So this was just one thing which I like very much about sharing. Okay, friends. So this is the case. Um, yes, good. 
Shaila, like to share something about what is your understanding about this case and about yes, this patient? Very very much. I would love to share because I really uh -huh. I'll just share my screen. My screen is seen. Yeah, Kushala, can you yes. make it full screen? Yeah. Is it seen now? Yes. Uh, you know, what I initially, when you were describing the case, or initially when I interacted the case, I found it so sensitive and so angry, feeling so injustice and all. So the first remedy without, uh, you know, to just feel it's the first first remedy which taffy then i started interacting with this case i said no there's much more than uh, you know just feeling sensitive it's also you me versus my another colleague I mean, it's like she is all the time comparing you know i am senior and you know she goes to get the post by seniority i'm more qualified and i should be getting so there was me versus you there was so much of Comparison, higher up, getting another position which was equally, you know, strong and um, equally good as her colleague. But her conflict was no. So I wanted to drill manager. Why didn't I get that? You know, that was her conflict, though she was given a parallel good post. And then going every day, it was like a, with her conflict. She had to survive in this situation to see her colleague in that post. So it's a process and a life story so when you come it has to be an animal kingdom so i felt there are a lot of features like she's so uh, you know ambitious and she's talking about heading a big company so i felt there were a lot of reptilian features in her because she was feeling that you know i'm feeling defenseless my other things going on they are you know favoring her though i am senior so she was feeling defenseless she was feeling weak powerless at a disadvantage competition you know i'm senior who is up like you know for her that post showed that one upmanship that i am more than her advantage when you know she the other colleague got the post so there was constant themes of you know, i'm superior or who's superior and who's inferior and she is not given anything so it's all about superior inferior you can see the subtle shade of jealousy in her she's split in her mind she can't act i'm also being given an equally good force so there's an antagonism with herself she's feeling very vulnerable pressed down she feels injured as if you know against her that why against me and she's trying to attack by you know going to the principal often and telling ki, i mean to the director of the company saying you know that you know this one you know i am better and you know why you are giving her that post into that i said if it's a reptile then you know which reptile it's like the, it has to be a reptile where it's one against a group and you're feeling so much of so then i felt the elapidae would be a, a reptile which feels so much injury from the environment so they have this strong theme of or they are sensitive to being injured so you have the delusion about to receive injury and they are very mild usually Actually, they don't, uh, they are not, they attack only when they are cornered, provoked or intruded. Now, she took this as an injury, as an attack. So, she started, you know, she, um, the managing director that, you know, see, see what is happening. Like, if you do this, then she had her own ways of, you know, counter-attacking by other roles, you know, that let that colleague only do his work. So, it was a subtle way of giving back. And uh, in reptiles, they have short fangs. So they are not, they won't give you one sharp bite and let go. They'll go on biting you repeatedly. They will go on and on and on. So this is what she was doing all through the case, you know. She was going on and on, you know, uh, going on complaining, you know, this is it. It's not fair. I'm, you know, what have I done? I'm also good. And, you know, I, I've done my work properly. 
So it's like your know, bites you are giving to the situation. They are active hunters. The elapid reptiles are active hunters. It's you know if somebody is threatened, they come and hit you again and again. If they get after something, they will stay and hold on. They'll persist. They will confront if they perceive any threat and this is what she was doing like she was just after it I mean, she was not ready to let go of the situation not caring whether they live or die it's like i'm alone this is unfair i'm alone everybody is playing politics everybody is against me it's like you know i'm one and the venom is neurotoxic so you will find the nervous system affected with love lot of paralysis, rapid failure, uh, you know, uh, suffocation. So this is what I felt he possibly, you know, we can think of a reptoba. I mean, if you could uh, put some light yeah. on it. I mean, this is where I felt so, where Thank I have reached. Thank you so much. Yes, Kushala. Yeah, so I would share my actuality. Is the screen visible? Kushala, is the screen visible? Yes. Yeah, yeah. The yes. screen is visible. Yeah. That is my uh, analysis. And yes, Kushala, you, uh, the way you were trying to, you know, interact in your mind, whether it is plant or whether it is the features that you explained in the detail is absolutely right and very, very good. Yeah, she is an animal remedy in my uh, analysis. So what I felt that, you know, the patient, the, the, what was coming up is it just was that she felt that to get what she deserved. She did not get that post of GM. That is what she felt she deserved it. And she always, she wanted, it was her right as per experience. And she had given 100% to the company and there is no doubt about it because there was no doubt about the duty she was giving 100% or even more than that. And that too, she used to do very, very sincerely. So she was a very duty conscious, by, but still what was hurting in her mind was that still, why not me? Then why not? I am, if I have given so much, then still why not me? So why, if I have given so much, what I got in return and I got unjust, I got rejection. I am neglected. That is what was coming to her shock. She was deeply hurt and she was angered. And what she was again feeling was that, oh, okay, I did not get someone got who is non-deserving, who got this post, who is non-deserving manager. She got it and she got it on a platter. So why this wrong happened with me? And the rubric that came to my mind was the delusion, wrong suffered he is okay and um, uh, she also you know the other rubric that I thought of was that she felt being injured by the surrounding injured by the teacher by that uh, uh, another uh, uh, manager another department manager who gave application for post she also felt a little bit injured by that principal also meaning the uh, uh, authority the director because she felt that uh, she went and spoke to him but still he did not pay that much attention to whatever you know uh, he gave that again post of gm to another manager so she also felt being neglected she was a and too much of duty conscious so when i took these rubrics the remedy which i got was Raja. Before that also, some other things is that now she doesn't want to do any extra work for that. And she felt that now you only do. And now when you wanted that post, now you only do. So this was a little bit of her revengeful attitude. So that this was, she was having this issue of me versus you. The anger which was a little bit uh, revengeful type. And it was an animal king. This complete thing, what was coming up was the emotional hurt and the sadness that was coming up very prominently. 
her chief vision which was again the heart affections uh, sleeplessness and depression so we wanted a remedy which would cover all this okay the remedy which was selected was naja tripodens and uh, friends i would also like to share the follow up so we, uh, she was given naja 200 um, in a weekly doses single doses weekly initially to stacha 1m so the follow up which came up was that her palpitation was better her sleep was better her restlessness was better her mood swings came down and she made conscious efforts from her side also to control herself so that awareness was also increasing it was already there in her the person it was already there she herself also had told us that quality was there but the efforts from her side was possible well she could let go thing uh, uh, exercise that control over her own self and because of that she felt mentally also very peaceful um and better yeah okay so with this detail of this will uh, nirupama like to say anything yeah shobha so basically fuis is which came in group was staphy and naja yeah. so staphy is the plant correspondence of the naja but naja mature adult stage it's a king series and staphy is that way belong to first subclass where we have injuries here this injuries in naja is very strong and naja belongs to school age similar level of development of happy the whole presentation how i look in society how i will be appreciated in society and is continuously has high energy to work towards it so what happens why then this disease develops so we have actually in our personality good me bad me and not me so exist in society to get appreciation power towards the good me part and that's why i reject my not me part but it comes throughout with us as a shadow we carry it so the whole focus of naj naja is on social acceptance but why so much you are working towards it of you you don't accept so yeah they are working towards it so what is school age it's a stage of moral degree of belonging it is the stage where peer conversation uh, develops there is a competition industry so see all you see in this case she is really working hard towards her goal towards her position but typically if you see ilapide has 10th column of mineral chart well crocarina has crossed so ilapide is working for the position they really have to work hard to below that so they, they have to reach that top that's a lot of sensation like how people around and what happens the shadow comes strong they will feel the manipulation they will feel how i'll be be injured from the peakly she said that there is a lot of politics around people are against me so th this is her shadow side very active and because it is uh, there is a lot of fear of rejection it, it goes into leprous smizm all this manipulation taking advantage of uh, the, this is the shadow side of the naja and, and there is a continuous fear surrounding their feel so uh, this is all about the pm understanding of the naja Yeah, Mama, very nice. So very nice PM in understanding. Ah, uh, yes, Aditi. Ah, uh, will you like to throw any light understanding about the case? Yeah, yeah, Shubha. See, basically, you know, ah, uh, in this case, we we are coming very strongly with the Staphylococcus and Naja, which both are very sensitive and they feel very hurt, basically. So from 
third we are coming to this student when we see staphysagria yes staphysagria is of staphysagria's main problem is hurt hurt due to dignity and and honor here on that part the dignity and honor is uh, affected in this case in this patient that is uh, hurt but what we are seeing uh, quality which is not generally seen in naja is wrong suffered feeling which is very strongly we feel in uh, naja but we do staphysagria staphysagria's main feeling is hurt hurt my my dignity is hurt my 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 honor is hurt and in naja i am wrong suffered i was i was due for this i was due for this promotion i was due for this post which is denied to me staphysagria being a planned remedy uh, you know it is more always working through its sensitivity all its reactions are through sensitivity so staphysagria when we see in our practice in our clinical uh, uh, clinics and all mm -hmm. what we see staphysagria when hurt these Way, they come more pains, acute pains, a neuralgic pains because nerves are the most sensitive part of our body, and when nerves are cut, when we see that acute sensitivity and acute pains, which we generally see in staphysagria much more. So even these, you know, also we can differentiate naja and staphysagria like this. Naja has a more uh, affection of. Heart, yeah, and uh, remedy always sleep. It has always got some relation with the sleep. Either they are aggravated in the sleep or they are aggravated in after sleep. Patient here also the patient came with palpitation and sleep issues more. So here also we can you know differentiate Naja, uh, Naja, Agria at that this level also. So when 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 we see Stephis Agria again, it comes more with the pain. So at the toothache level at the level uh, at the skin level because now again if we see uh, staphysagria comes in the first class so they are very people they are very sensitive people so their skin is affected more in staphysagria so uh, this is how you know uh, when we uh, differentiation these are uh, the points we can uh, consider more and staphysagria yeah, is we always seen very gentle people, very sweet talking people. So so naja also. But when they are hurt, their their reactions are at a and from there we can uh, differentiate them much yes, better. Because naja is finally the yeah. poison of Indian so, cobra. That yes, is, correct. The difference we will get at the level yeah. of the plant steffi and the Indian cobra naja. Correct. Correct, correct. This, this is how, uh, yes, right, right. sleeplessness you were saying it belongs to womb hmm. stage of development. Hmm. So, I have womb stage, adult stage, and king series. Correct, correct. Correct. Hmm. correct. Yeah, yeah. So, this is, we can uh, differentiate yeah, Naja good. and Staphysagria further. Yes, very good, very good. Yes, Anita. Uh, um, will you like about some rubrics, some uh, one meaning the single remedy rubrics or some other rubrics of the important rubrics of Naja? Yes, Shobha. Please share my BPT. Yeah. One thing I wanted to point out till she uh, starts the PPT is uh, when she said Indian Cobra. So the, you know, uh, the difference between Lachesis and Naja is that Naja is an Indian Cobra. So they have Indian values. So basically they are more into suppression and they are more duty conscious. So they will, you know, perform their du duties and their uh, negative qualities, like which come up uh, very uh, forthrightly in Lachesis, they are subdued. So it is also known as mild Lachesis. If you see it, uh, the expressions are very mild. The under underneath psychodynamics and whatever emotions are going on, the projection which uh, uh, Nirupama talked about, the shadow side and all that, that is there, but it is subdued. I have tried to, you know, focus on main 
core rubrics which are single remedy rubrics of naja shobha you have not opened it no it's not there no no your uh, index is seen oh, sorry acha okay uh, from my end it was there okay okay i will share it again just a moment can you see this yeah so these are all the single remedy rubrics from complete repertory anger guilt with anguish or spot yes yes anxiety heart region full screen grief after so uh, this is what uh, even aditi talked about that they have more of heart pathology rather than nerve pathology so delirium paroxysmal twice a day in cerebrospinal meningitis uh delusions misfortune uh, images phantom sees misfortune over imaginary so there are a lot of rubrics related to brooding over imaginary disease brooding over imaginary troubles so this is again the part of projection which may not be real but they perceive it that way and that is why the brooding goes on and this patient also complained of lot of overthinking and she was continuously thinking whether you know uh, i will get the due uh, position or not why why me and all those things and delusion sees wrong of possible wrong doing possible wrong doing is which could have been possible possible wrong doing which has not taken place but it can be possible in future imaginations injury being injured of on head basically like uh, other people also said that it is it belongs to king series and in head represents your ego you held your head hold your head high so head represents your ego head represents your thinking capacity head represents your brain head represents your intellect so basically they feel the injury which is coming to hit their head in duty neglected headache during this talks about the sense of duty naja has that in spite of headache they would like to work and if their work suffers because of headache also they will feel that they have neglected the duty this speaks of the conscience very high conscience of naja imagination she is in a terrible cold carriage turned over hurting her head she is in a terrible cold rain storm and carriage turned turned over hurting her head so this is you know how in rain storm when you are sitting inside the carriage you are you are protected so the rain storm is very terrible that means the situation in which you are is quite terrible and it is like unpredictable thunderstorm rain storm rain storm is generally unpredictable you can't understand the intensity of the onslaught so this is they are in the rain storm but carriage which was supposed to protect them turned over and hurt her head so here she was looking up to her higher authorities that uh, seeing her performance seeing her duties see they will protect her they will protect her rights but what they have done without informing her the other lady was made the manager so they hurt her on her head she was always asking i am deserving then why not me so this is how she was hurt her hurt or on, on her uh, position on her head imagination wasting away he is wasting away is you are your power is wasting away your power is going down Mus wasting we generally talk about muscular wasting so when muscles become thin they become powerless they become weak we talk about wasting away so her power is wasting away because she has not given that post and power always comes with pay, uh, post dreams frightful nightmare sadness with dreams plans tomorrow for so
so they also think about tomorrow they are anxious about tomorrow you will get lot of anxiety rubrics in naja they are anxious about their children they are anxious about their own health and all that fancies misfortune evening uh, failure of sexual again it talks about the power split his head in two this is the this talks about the duality of the naja indian cobra that is being a snake they have animal quality but being indian cobra they have beauty consciousness they have high conscience so their head will uh, split into two if they allow their you know animal quality to come forth they will lose on morality or duty consciousness or their values and if they give way to their violence or aggression they will be you know going into bad conscience or guilt again mental exertion incapacity for from chronic headache they are not able to perform because they think too much about the other things sadness with distress about sexual organs sexual organs are the organs which represent the performance sadness with superfluous feeling now what is superfluous superfluous is something which is not needed it is it is you know something extra it is like a in a coffee mug lot of froth is there foam is there to look at it looks very nice but you know it fills up the cup when you actually it settles down you will come to know that cup was hard, hardly you know three fourth filled or half filled but because of froth it was looking so full so upper froth or uh, that foam is superfluous which doesn't have any substance any matter in that so we will go to the other uh, slides where i have uh, represented the images also uh, we will complete this first sadness as if having done everything wrong way during headache so they have this conscience that during complaints also their performance should not get affected and they have this again very high conscience of right and wrong and duty consciousness that they should not do anything wrong so you get lot of rubrics of wrong in naja doing wrong wrong suffered everything is going wrong shrieking screaming shouting as if it would take away their breath so they inside there is so much of pressure you know but still they continue do performing their duties suicidal disposition x with an if you think of you know somebody committing ex, uh, suicide with x it would be so aggressive and so violent and so you know uh, gory so they have so much of violence inside them but be, their front is very mild their what they present is very mild that shows their suppression shobha change the slide i have covered all these but it, i have pictorial yes. pictorially yes. present all this delusion brainstorm she is in a terrible cold and cariach turned over hurting her head this is how you know you are traveling in rainstorm and your cariach turns over and what type of troubles it can lead to generally you know you go by car you don't go on bike when it is raining because you will get all round protection delusion ha huh. next delusion head injured of being head implies important part of the body or organization we talk about head of organization also which controls everything so head injury leads to lots of consciousness control and power next this is wasting away see how it is melting away wasting is used for loss of muscle mass which ultimately leads to loss of power and importance so this is how naja loses their power because of their duty consciousness and because of their morality of not fighting back so they go into lot of uh, suppression because of domination because of wrong suffered sadness superfluous feeling with what is meaning of the word superfluous like they have explained like in our political system also there is vice president 
vice president doesn't have any role or responsibility but he is only just for signing the documents so exceeding what is sufficient or necessary so the post is redundant it doesn't have any value not needed unnecessary the textbook includes so much superfluous information that students often overlook key points so basically they cover the key points next consciousness paralysis with this is from radar keynotes uh, sorry radar synthesis repertory so this is consciousness paralysis they realize everything they understand everything they comprehend the situation very well they are very much conscious but because of their morality their hands are tied they lose their power and they become paralyzed so this is this picture depicts how you know paralysis with consciousness that is more pain, painful you know if a person is unconscious and has paralysis he will not have that recognition of pain or suffering delusion being starved not getting enough nourishment love appreciation and recognition that means they are being neglected and they are being rejected they are being forsaken so this this is what you know it shows that they are being starved they are not being nourished with motivation like this lady is not given motivation so she is starved of the recognition which she is deserving so this is all from my point uh shobha you want to add anything this is uh, the way we all said the different aspects of the naja which is uh, we all tried to you know in, in, through this integration we tried to give the different aspects the mind rubrics from the pm method from the kingdom differentiation and the differential remedy stevisegia which is coming so close from the plant kingdom at uh, very much nearby from the sensitivity point of it now anybody and the rem, the naja being come, coming so close to uh, this is you know there's a snake when we see a lot of patients we think that they are looking like, similar to lecases but they are right sided the we know left sided but then when we see that the patients complaints are right sided and they are chilly whereas lecases is a hot and the left sided remedy then we should naja in such cases also where we see that if they are too much of beauty conscious and who are little milder on that and if added with that wrong suffered feeling and the neglected thing which is there then naja should definitely be thought of so this is what it is anybody from any uh, all of you anyone wants to add anything which is coming to your mind and if you th think that we have uh, missed it See, for lacases, amusement yes. is very important. They are more self-centered. They go, yes. uh, you know, they want enjoyment. And if that enjoyment yes. is not there, they go into pathology. So pathology from inhibition, inhibition of their, uh, the, their uh, desires or their enjoyment or their indulgences. So that is what lacases is. It goes into sublime. Right. when the environment is very stimulating and they are enjoying themselves so they are not so beauty conscious though it is there in strong responsibility also but the focus is not on beauty in naja it is more of you know it nobility there it gives a sense of nobility so when you see lacases you get charged up you know they are very magnetic they are very animated they are, they are very vivacious but naja when you see they are quite sad depressed mild so you know sadness you if you catch sadness then you can think of naja very well yes naja is sadness and like this is bitterness which is very coming up you know prominently yes yeah and naja has lot of domination so there is uh, you know uh, dr master has described that it is you know like a dutiful daughter in law who has been dominated by the mother in law or a dutiful 
subordinate who is being dominated by the boss. So a lot of domination is there, which also leads to wrongs effort, but still they continue to uh, do their duty along with the uh, this negative suffering of sadness and discontentness and all that. Yes, Kushala wanted to add something. Yeah, what uh, Anita also said that, you know, this amusement or its extroversion is inhibited, then it goes into pathology. So that's why we have that amelioration. No? So when you are freely flowing, when there's profusion or there is flow of discharges, there is amelioration in lattices. Yes, 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 yes. And Yes, friend. So that is how, you know, we are we have integrated the different uh, thoughts, of, uh, the thoughts of different schools and uh, what, uh, how we come to Naja through that. Right, Anita? Yes, there are many other facets. We are not going into all the rubrics. We are strict, restricting ourselves to this particular case and single, ru uh, single remedy rubrics in a future on the you know, future we can share more cases of Naja and try to complete the understanding. Naja. Yes. Okay, friends. Anything? Anybody wants to say I'll anything? Just add one point. Like every yes, Nirupama. Snake has seduction. Every snake has seduction. Naja, seduction is duty. They will overdo. They will just show how beautiful I am. See, you have to catch Naja because everywhere they'll, they will express their duty. While well, lattice is seduction is plastic. Like every age change their seduction. They are so intellectual. So if they are in home, their seduction will be different. If they are at work, there will be different seduction. And if they are out, it's a different seduction. It is that plastic. So it is the right side of the mineral. Like they have crossed the 10th. So they are more in while Naja, the, the whole focus is duty. That is their seduction. They like to be known as dutiful. That is what I wanted to add. Yes. Fantastic. So with this, so shall we end this? Yes, Anita, will you like to end it? We will conclude today's session. Hmm. But friends, please subscribe to our channel for the future notifications because people are asking me whether we are going to conduct any sessions, seminars and webinars. That is not in the uh, immediate future plan. We will be recording all the sessions and we will be sharing it on YouTube. So please follow us on YouTube and wait for the notifications. Thank you so much. And keep encouraging us. Thank you. All. And friends, also put your comments and uh, any any queries coming in your mind. We will definitely try and solve. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.